How do I turn this on? Probably should plug it in first. Oh, wow. What's going on guys? How's your day going? Hopefully it's going great. Now we have ran into some major, major problems. So I just imported all my photos from yesterday, which should be today's video, you know, looking at the footage and two clips that I filmed got absolutely destroyed. Like for some reason they won't import, something happened to them and they're the main piece of this whole video. So I'm gonna recreate what I said yesterday and then tell you guys what this is. So now imagine this was yesterday, this is what I was going to say to you. So just like a normal day, I wanted this to be a fun vlog. I wanted you know to go out and film some stuff. So it was a normal day, I went to school, hang out with Matt, you know, try to make a stupid joke with Matt. In my room right now, nobody else is in here except for Matt. Wait, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. And then I actually ended up going to the gym and I was working out and I just got to thinking about this question that my professor asked us yesterday. And he asked us, how often do you go to the movies? It was in my cinema class and it absolutely amazed me. The average answer was once or twice a year. Once or twice a year. Now me personally, I go like every week to a movie. Even when I came to Vienna, I went to two movies here. So I wanted to explain to you guys why film is so important to me and why it's so sufficient to my life and what it means to me. So when I was younger, I was always super fascinated by films. Absolutely loved them, loved concepts of them, loved storylines, all this stuff behind them. But then like when I was in like, you know, seventh, eighth grade, whenever I moved out to Union, and I went through like a really low point where I had like no friends, nobody talked to me, got made fun of a lot. All this stuff had long hair, you know, so it was like typical and the only part that I got to escape from life was movies. I got to forget about stuff. I got to forget about all the bullshit in the world. And I actually just got to sit down and enjoy myself. And it pulls this type of emotion out of you where you don't think about stuff. You don't think about what's going on in your own life. And it just immerses you into that film that you're watching. And no matter what film it is, you're immersed into it no matter what. And that kind of brings me to the point of that they're so important to me because they helped me get, like not get through stuff, but they helped me, you know, escape from stuff. It helped me realize all the emotions that films can bring out in you. And that's the thing is any film can bring out any emotion in you. And that is the most amazing thing about film. Now is the second part of my speech that was filmed yesterday that didn't get deleted. Here we go. And then this reminds me of why I started filming in the first place. You create something for an audience to enjoy, to feel like they can leave their lives, that they can leave their jobs, do anything and just relax, enjoy something for two hours, get away from the world. And that's why I do these. And then I realized that that's the whole thing about what I do. Like that's why I make these daily videos for you guys is hopefully I can take five, 10 minutes out of your day to make you feel better. Even though I know a lot of times it doesn't, maybe it does, I don't know. But it's, it's just a thing that I really enjoy and hopefully you guys enjoy it too. And now I've noticed, and I really noticed this. Now I just went down freaking nostalgia lane and watched like 15 of my first videos. And let me just say this. They were horrible, absolutely horrible. Now I can say 100% without a doubt, these videos have gotten 150 times better. And you don't really realize it because you do it every single day, but I have noticed it now and I've like developed personality and I'm not so shy around the camera and I'm not so quiet and I'm not all this stuff that makes me what I didn't want to be. And I know this is kind of like getting off the topic of the films, but basically what I'm saying is that is why I love films and that is why I do films. So hopefully you guys enjoy like this one-on-one -on -one talk with me. Now, I want you to put in the comment section below what your absolute favorite movie is. Let me know why it's your favorite movie. It can be any movie, I don't care what it is. It can be a short film, it can be a video. Let me know who your favorite creator is on YouTube. And if you think about it, go more in depth. Why is it your favorite movie? What makes it so special to you? So I was kind of getting sick of doing the daily video thing, just repeating exactly what it did. So it's really nice to have a sit down conversation like this one on one. And it's very weird because there's nobody talking to me, but there's all of you people that can watch me. So it's, it's a very good feeling, very great feeling just to get away and communicate and uh, let you guys know what's going on. And if you're wondering about this lighting situation that I have and you've never seen it before, there's a reason for that. I turned on this light up here. I've never used this overhead light and I got my phone light here. Let me know if you like more talks like these, because if you do, I'll do more of them. Don't forget to subscribe, by the way, if you're new. Hopefully you enjoy these videos, and stick around. They're only gonna get better. So, until tomorrow, guys, have a great rest of your day. Always stay dope, later. Baby, baby.